We have an amazing history of publishing at Lucasfilm. We have been telling stories for over 35 years, and now with an unprecedented slate of new entertainment, we have this incredible opportunity to introduce a whole new generation of young readers to the world of Star Wars. To reach those fans, we went to top talent, best-selling children's authors, Tom Engelberger, Tony DiTerlizzi, Adam Gidwitz, and R.J. Palacio. All four of these authors bring their lifelong passion for Star Wars, and now they're going to be able to interpret the uh, stories of Star Wars in their own unique way. We'll kick off this fall with Tony's book, which is a uh, retelling of episode four, five, and six. It's a storybook with art by Ralph McQuarrie. I was absolutely honored to be able to try to put um, Ralph's illustrations in a storybook kind of format. These images, they're really coming right out of dialogue between George, the screenplay, and Ralph. So you're really getting almost the pure imagery, which I love because that's really what illustration is about, is about taking these ideas and notions and story and really bringing them to life. Help me, Obi-Wan Kenobi. I remember seeing the first Star Wars movie when I was 13 years old, and it just resonated with me. It's the most basic story. Story of a boy who undergoes this quest. And um, that's how I kind of want to tell the story. I'm hoping that kids will sort of be able to relate to Luke in a way that the movies might not let them relate to him. Getting to write these books is a great chance to really focus on those characters again. It breaks my heart to hear kids say stuff like they didn't like the special effects in the originals and stuff like that. I want to give it to them in this incredible form and let them see it the way I saw it when it just blew my mind. My favorite episode is and has always been episode five, The Empire Strikes Back. So the fact that I got asked to do that is just beyond amazing. Children really want to encounter things that are dark. Not all of them, but the vast majority do. They want to be a little bit scared. They want to feel like there is real danger because only when there is real danger can they be heroic in defeating the danger? And I think episode five, being as dark and scary as it is, makes Luke's ultimate triumph all the more satisfying to the reader. We have tapped Ian McKaig, concept artist for the prequel trilogy, who will be illustrating each of these novels. He is probably best known for the creation of the villain Darth Maul, and Padme Amidala. And we're thrilled to have him uh, interpreting the original trilogy. This most recent generation of Star Wars fans grew up on the prequels. Their Star Wars is The Phantom Menace, Attack of the Clones, and Revenge of the Sith. So now we have an opportunity to introduce them to the original Star Wars. A New Hope, Empire Strikes Back, and Return of the Jedi. We are so proud to be publishing this slate of authors. These stories will engage young readers and get them ready for the journey that is episode seven and beyond.